backbeat was the musical paradigm shift of the century. Its power and simplicity made it endlessly adaptable, and it soon had people dancing all over the world. This is the word, according to Chad Smith, raconteur, snappy dresser, and engine of power. His band, the Red Hot Chili Peppers, are a mix of flavors that spans the spectrum of popular music from rock through funk to hip hop. If anyone knows something about how the backbeat changed music, it's this guy. This is the BBC drum, Stuart Copeland drum fest extravaganza. This is the beginning of the world as we know it. That's right. In fact, we were about to define how the world as we know it is formed, is shaped, is led, is created by the backbeat. Why do you suppose it is that two and four, one, two, three, four, uh, ties together so many different kinds of music? So the backbeat is a very important part of drumming and modern music. It makes people dance. And that's what, what I want those people that we're playing it for to feel that and start to dance and move and boogie, a little bit of boogie. One of the first bands to make us boogie to the backbeat were those Mersey lads known very aptly as the Beatles. In Ringo Starr, the Beatles were truly blessed. His highly original patterns helped make his group the most influential band of all time. So what about feel? How does feel play into it? The way that you place your limbs on the drums, how you do it in time, your feel of how you interpret your inner clock, like time, like natural feel of time, like you know, Ringo. The songs feel good, and to me then it, again, it goes back to it makes you want to dance, it makes you want to move. There's something in there that lifts it above the organ. 